Church Tech Weekly presents Infocom 2013, brought to you by Bose Professional Systems, committed to developing best-in-class products, tools, and services to create original audio experiences. All right, well, continuing our 2013 coverage of Infocom, we've uh, come over to the Martin booth where we can kind of barely see in here. Yeah, a lot of, uh, you can tell we're in the lighting section of Infocom right now. Um, I'm here with Daryl Sutton at Martin Lighting, and uh, you guys have come out with some kind of new products. You're certainly known for, you know, the, the big, big high-end lights, moving lights, uh, the uh, 101s, LEDs, that kind of stuff. But uh, you kind of saw a hole in the market, and uh, kind of created some new product line to fill that hole. So why don't you tell us about the new uh, series here? Yeah, absolutely. Um, well, Martin started out 25 years ago kind of as an entry-level product uh, company manufacturer and more the mobile DJ segment. Um, over the years, as you mentioned, we kind of moved on to the uh, the pro side of things and we just realized we needed to kind of get back to our roots. And uh, so we did that and by in doing that, we actually showed our commitment to the entry-level product range by actually branding it um, with the Rush by Martin. Still going to be supported by uh, Martin distribution channel will be the same uh, but we're, we're showing our commitment to the market on the entry-level product range there'll be some effects products as you'll see in here what we're gonna look at is the first six uh, of, of roughly about a 24 fixture platform that we're looking at um, but there'll be some effects but a lot of staging application products that we maybe didn't have in the past right. um, so awesome so we've got six products or well, actually five that we're going to talk about here yep. um, that I think have application to the house of worship market so you know just kind of going down the line uh, what do we have here okay excellent uh, the, the first unit that's here is uh, the, the the rush strobe. Um, it is, uh, uh, as you can see, a multi-pixeled uh, white LED uh, strobe unit. Uh, it can be used for uh, crowd blinding as well, or as you can see, uh, also uh, different effects that can be put together in blocks. Um, runs 120 volt operation. It's a really nice unit. Yeah. Awesome. And then we've got a, a really, really tight beam unit here. Yeah, this is the uh, MH3 beam. The MH3 beam has a, a platinum 5R lamp. Uh, it's a uh, one to three degree zoom. It has a, a static gobel wheel, a color wheel. Um, basic functionality, throws far, real intense, really a nice collimated type light, uh, kind of that shaft of light type feel, yeah. Yeah, and it is crazy, crazy bright too. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Platinum R lamp is great. Yeah, exactly. Then we got a little, a great little uh, LED par, which has uh, become kind of a staple in uh, the LED world now. Yeah, absolutely. We'll, we'll talk about both of these products at the same time. Um, we have the MH2 moving head wash, and then we also have the, uh, the, the Rush Par 1. Both of the fixtures have the same exact optics um, built into it. They're seven 10 watt quad LEDs, so you have red, blue, green, and white. Um, 20 degree beam angles. The PAR obviously is, uh, is Martin's first fixed yoke, which I'm very excited about for the church market especially. Um, and then we have a wash fixture as well that has full 540 degrees pan, 267 degrees tilt. So you have a moving version and a fixed version that have the same optical uh, output and uh, performance. You can use them side by side. Very cool. Then way down at the end, we've got a uh, another LED moving uh, yoke fixture. Yeah, this is the uh, MH1. Uh, it's uh, our, our profile unit. It actually has a static gobel wheel, uh, uh, rotating gobel wheel, a static, uh, or excuse me, a dichroic color wheel. Uh, it does have remote focus. It has a, a prism as well as an iris. Uh, it is LED based lamp source. If you're familiar with our previous Mac 250 product range, this is basically a Mac 250 with an LED lamp source, has the same output, 4,700 lumens for the light output, but it also has an iris. So. Very cool. So pricing, uh, maybe we'll just walk our way back down here. Pricing, what are we looking at for these guys? Uh, on the MH1 profile, uh, MSRP is $19.95, so very well priced. Um, the MH2 wash uh, is a $1,095 list, so that's very impressive as well. The PAR1 list for $4.95. Uh, the uh, MH3 beam is $27.95, and the Rush strobe, sorry, I had to think about that one for a second. The, uh, the Rush strobe is $9.95 list. Awesome. So some really great initial product offerings in the Rush line. And uh, Daryl, when are these going to be available? When can people get their hands on these things? We'll be shipping them August 1st. August 1st. So, um, and uh, website for uh, people to get more information? www.martinpro.com. Okay, and there's a Rush segment in there somewhere? There is. If you go to the right-hand side under products, it'll actually be a main tab there. It says Rush. Awesome. So, uh, martin.com. Look at uh, Martin. Martin.com, Martin Pro. MartinPro.com. There we go. I got to get it right. MartinPro.com. Look for the Rush tag and uh, the first six ones, and uh, you got a lot more coming out. So if you're looking for some new lighting fixtures, could be a good time to look at Martin. Excellent. All right. Thanks, Daryl. Thanks.